This is Open Mailbox. Today I'm going to show you how to get started setting up a database connection for your local Onset server. Onset is a modding platform where developers and modders can create their own unique games and experiences using a bunch of great tools. Onset comes with support for establishing a MariaDB connection to a database. MariaDB is an open source fork of MySQL, which means that the APIs are mostly compatible. Now, if you're like me and you already have MySQL installed locally for something else, that means you shouldn't really have to install MariaDB. You can just use the uh, Maria client libraries through Onset to talk to your MySQL database. Otherwise, if you need to download MariaDB or MySQL, just go to their respective websites and um, look for the download links and download either database for your platform. Once you have a database up and running, it's time to write some code. Now, if you followed my prior video on getting started with coding and onset, you'll already have a hello world package with a command that's set up and ready to go. We're going to build on top of that. First, we'll declare a global variable that will be used to hold a reference to our MariaDB connection. Then we'll define and initialize several local variables for the configuration options for the MariaDB connection. Um, so this is your host, your port, your username, your password. This is the part where I pause for a disclaimer and say that storing your database credentials in plain text in your code is a horrible security practice and you should never actually do that for a production system. Uh, but for this, for this exercise, we're just trying to demonstrate how to get things running. So this is what we're going to do. Now we're going to create a function to initialize our database. First, we're going to set the log level to debug. So there's lots of great information in the, in the uh, Maria log when something inevitably goes wrong. Then we're going to initialize the database connection to the global reference that we created earlier. Uh, the connection string here is the host colon port and this MariaDB function. Um, I'll show you where that comes from later in the developer documentation. After we've attempted to initialize the database connection, we're going to check to see if we were successful. If we were, then everything is fine and we'll just uh, write something useful into the server log. If not, then we're actually going to exit the entire process and not start the server. The assumption is that uh, you'll reach the point where your code depends on the database and we actually don't even want to bother starting if we can't establish that connection. Once we have a function to initialize our database connection, we're going to register that function with onset so that it's executed when the package starts. Now we're going to modify our existing hello world command. Instead of immediately printing a message to the chat, we're going to prepare and execute a database query. Now, we're not actually interpolating any variables here, so we don't have to prepare the statement, but it's good to get into the practice of doing it anyways. Again, these MariaDB functions, I'll show you where in the developer documentation you can find them at the end of the video. Now we're using an asynchronous database query here so that we're not blocking the main thread while we wait for the response from the database. So that means we need a callback function to handle the results once the query comes back. So we're going to define the callback function here, and then we're just going to read the return value using the get value index function. And then finally, we can go back and now add our chat message to the player's chat window. And this time we're just going to interpolate the timestamp variable onto the end of it. Once you're done, copy the hello world folder back into the packages directory of the server and then start the server. If everything is correct, you'll see the log message establishing the MariaDB connection. With the server running, open up your onset client, connect to localhost, and once you're into the game, just type slash hello in the chat window and you should see your hello world message followed by the current uh, date and time. I mentioned earlier I would show you where to find the documentation for MariaDB. Uh, go back to playonset.com, go down to the bottom of the developer wiki, and you'll find a link to the MariaDB client function reference. That's it for setting up your MariaDB connection in Onset. If you found the video useful, please subscribe to the channel, leave a like, um, and if you're looking for help with something specific, leave a comment and let me know. Maybe I can work it into my next few tutorials.